Hey, Legion, and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes of Might and Magic 6. Yeah, that's right, I did a review last time, still ain't done with the game. <laughs> Maybe I'm gonna regret what I said. Or I won't, I don't know. <laughs> uh, I did forget to talk about plot hoes, but hey, whatever. I still enjoyed the game. What's that? Five scanning radius. That is the best dynasty trait ever! Yeah, no. Alright, let's start being a pirate already. Hunkering for some pillaging. Uh, it's better to have less thunder in the mouth and more lightning in the hand. Uh, okay. I see. Clever. I guess. <laughs> uh, have a big weapon is better than just having big words. Between the time when the second eclipse reddened the skies and the rise of the sons of Twidhana, there was an age of turmoil. Taking place on the fringe of these world-changing events, many stories were left unrecorded in the scrolls of the Blind Brothers. Yet, there is one hero whose name transcended memory and whose outrageous feats remain vivid in the hearts of all the townsfolk, from the markets of Cathal to the docks of Hammerfall. This man was known as Crag Hack. Red-haired, one-eyed, a sellsword, a barbarian, a pirate! The time has come to tell the events I witnessed so many years ago. Let me tell you of the days of swashbuckling adventure. It all started in the year that followed the eclipse. Many ships were lost in storms as sudden as they were treacherous. Many experienced captains and crews disappeared in the unforgiving waters. As these supernatural tempests became more and more frequent, a rumor started to spread in the taverns of the Savage Islands. These signs and omens could have but one meaning. A thunderbird had made its nest somewhere in the islands, each fluttering of its mighty wings, spawning hurricanes and bringing devastation. Of course, there were some who shunned these stories as mere superstition. They were wrong. As the ranks of the free sailors were being decimated, the Pirate Council held an extraordinary session and summoned the only man they felt could put an end to this threat. Because pirates are organized. Yes, of course. So, my fellow captains, the Pirate Council of the Savage Sea is now in session. Just get on with it and tell me what you want from me. Hey, let's get to business. I was in the middle of an important experiment. The matter we need to discuss relates to the recent wave of violent storms in the Savage Sea. Surely you've heard about it. Aye, many a good friend went dancing with the fishes recently. Good sailors, those lads. Yeah, a storm is a storm. Ain't nothing you can do about it. Except if you're a wizard, that is. Yet there is something wrong with these storms. We sea elves can feel it. Killing sailors. Not way of Father Sky. Shamans agree on that. So, you believe it's what? <laughs> Magical storms? Did you hear the rumors about the giant bird that was spotted during these storms? Nope. A thunderbird, you mean? Ain't been a thunderbird in the Savage Islands for decades. Kamal here's granddad saw to that. Indeed. My illustrious grandfather, the great Captain Rama, killed the last Thunderbird in this part of the world. Yet all signs point to the singular conclusion. A Thunderbird has reappeared and is the cause of all the recent havoc. Oh yeah, no? Yeah, I got it. So what? Take your ship and deal with it. Aren't you the Pirate King or something? You know there's been no Pirate King since my grandfather died, and the proof of his rank, his sword, was lost. We believe the Thunderbird has made its nest in the reef barrier. We need someone to confirm our suspicions. You are the best navigator of the Savage Sea, Captain Hack. If someone can find his way through the reefs and these storms, it's you. Why should I be taking all the risks? I'm not even part of your council. And besides, I'm retired. Of course, there will be a reward if you bring back proof of the bird's existence. 
Even more so if the proof turns out to be the friggin' bird's head. You know me all too well, Ilbart, old boy. All right, retirement Who's Hilbert? is starting to get boring anyway. I guess I Grimstone. No to another adventure. Oh dear. This is the closest I can get to the reef barrier. I'll leave the revenge anchored here and see if some of these island folks have seen my bird. My bird. There's a there's an icon saying that I can go there. It's lying. All right. Uh, one thing I wanted to mention because I. I was wrong about something. This thing here, uh, the pets—they actually matter. I didn't think, I didn't know that. So yeah, like this cub thing here. All enemy creature stacks suffer from a random negative effect picked among chilled, dazed, frozen, soaked. So that cub thing that was following me the whole time—it actually was useful. I didn't know that. Um, do, I want, do I want a dynasty weapon? Whatever. Doesn't matter. Uh, I do want some skills, though. That would be fantastic. Alright, you start at level 10. You have quite a few skills to pick. This is always a useful one. This one as well, but I'm going to wait on it because I have some more important things. Tactics. You obviously want tactics. You want both reinforcements, actually. You're not going to be using reinforcements, too. You're not going to have um, elites quite yet, but you're going to get them way before you get to level 11. You want that already. Um, what else? I'm going to go blood, so I guess I'm going to go heroism, just so I can make use of blood, I guess. You also obviously want some healing. A lot of healing. Yeah, that should be enough. I am uh, an orc, so I don't get the plus mana, which is really bad for me. I might add, and I'm sure I'm forgetting something. Hmm, Tactics 2 sounds really good, but I think I'm gonna go for initiative. I'm really tempted to go initiative. Yeah, let's go initiative. This, is, this should be good enough for now. We are going to gain levels, you know. It's just gonna take forever because we're gonna be fighting extremely small stacks for a while. Oh dear. And I'm gonna lose troops already. That's that's just absolutely fantastic. You know, if I had tactics three, I'd be in cover. <laughs> that would be fantastic. All right, I'm gonna put you here. I think they are in range of the goblins if they're here. Hold on, five. So yeah, they're barely in range. Fantastic. Okay, they the goblins are probably gonna shoot the molars like in the practice. So let's just prevent that. Oh boy. No, you killed something. You still haven't killed something, but you're going to... Oh, I have more movement. Well, I don't need more movement, thank you. I want more luck. This is probably not the thing I need, but you know what? Screw you. Screw this guy and this guy, and they're both gonna shoot at me, but I'm gonna be lucky and kill them. Oh dear god. Yeah, and this is only going to give me initiative right now. So, oh, you can you can get far enough to tie them both down. That's good. You don't need that, but that's good. Ah, goddammit. What was the point of putting you there if you're not getting lucky? So, using your, your guy's attack is always very tempting. Because it kills a whole lot of dudes, you know? And that's always good. Oh, look. Look at that. Mmm, now it gives attack. That's good. Alright, kill this one. Because that's the most dangerous one. And the other one is going to run away and get killed by my hero right next turn. Unless it goes first by some kind of bullshit. It didn't though. Good. At least I didn't do worse than the computer. I only lost one molar, which was a reinforcement, so it didn't really matter. Uh, there's a few. I can take on a few, can I? Ooh, that's that's a few more than I wanted to fight there. I guess. Okay. Hmm. Two and two. Can I kill one? No. Heroes not quite good enough. Okay, you stay there. Ba -dum. Move. Okay. <laughs> that was a completely wasted turn on my part. But I can kill someone now, I guess. Yeah, let's kill you. 
Ha! They're gonna get their stag back, like, next turn, but, you know, they die now. It's good, right? Not really. Okay, so petrification is extremely popular in these parts. I get it. Molars, go! You know what? I don't have to go. Screw you. Don't have to do this. Okay, you're gonna move. You're gonna move. Okay, I'm letting them get to my goblins almost, so I, I need to do something now. Something such as attack you, and even if you don't kill something, my maulers will. And this way they can't get to the goblins either. I think. They probably... yeah, they can't. Good. Why did you get... that's... bird. Why? Okay, hold on. I got this, don't worry. So I killed one again. Oh, it's almost dead. I can't kill him though. Oh, hey, hold on. Nope, molars still don't play fast enough. Then I will put a trap here and stop them. Ha, screw you, buddy. You're dead. Ah, all right. Traps, they're useful sometimes. Don't you know? Oh man, this is probably the map you are going to see traps the most, I guess. You probably already have seen traps the most out of any other map I've played. Um, is it me or these stacks are stronger than a normal? They would be. Yes, they probably are. I kind of uh, don't like that. Okay, I am going to reinforce these because they're probably going to die. At least lose one guy on the first turn. Kill one, kill one, kill... No! Failure. God damn it. It would have reduced the damage they did by a slight margin. Which would have been good, but no. And now they're undercover, which I... I hope they're still going to be shooting there, you know? Boom, and I guess kill, kill one, maybe? Still no! You stupid goblins keep failing miserably at everything I ask you to do. That's just dumb. Uh, yeah, the counterattack is not, is not gonna kill the molar. No worries about that. Because they're doing half damage. Oh my god, that's still quite a bit of damage. Well, I got something for that. Boom. Oh man, you cannot fail. You're gonna kill one no matter what. There you go. Alright. Uh, the shout is completely pointless. Whatever. Oh no, they're gonna run and then play first, aren't they? They're gonna get a shot off! Yes, they are. Oh god. You had better not kill one. I would have been angry. <laughs> would have had to use my mana. That's not good. Oh dear god, yes. Really not good. Uh, molars. Wood. I like the wood. Hmm. It, yeah. I'll be back towards here eventually, but yeah. Is it me or is this map different? I don't remember this map being like this. No, 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 okay, I remember. It's fine. I'm, I'm just crazy, don't mind me. One of you... Uh, I don't like that. Die. <laughs> Actually, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna trap him to keep him out of the fight for a little longer than they otherwise would have been out of the fight. Man, I'm talking all weird. I feel like it, anyways. Um, is that a good idea? Is the counterattack gonna kill something? I would guess... I would guess that's a really bad idea, so I'm not going to do anything. And instead I'm going to attack uh, this one. Boom! They're all completely insignificant, kind of. You can kill one! Maybe? Yes! He didn't fail for once! Good job! Hmm. <clears throat> kill it. Kill it! Good! Yes! Now you can... you're probably gonna die, so... Here. Take a hit. They're gonna attack them anyways, so... 
tank that hit and counter. I would have liked a critical there, but I guess you can't always have what you want. You can't always have nice things. Okay. I was hoping you would kill them. Uh, that can kill them. How much HP do you have? 33? The chance of this killing it? Oh, it, I would have to do maximum damage. Screw that, you're not killing this guy. <laughs> oh, no in hell you're killing this guy. You are, however, going to get attacked. Um, and I don't want you to, because you can't kill the dude. Okay, you're gonna run away so that they attack the molars and die on the counter-attack without killing a molar and then the molars are going to attack the molars and kill them. Yay! That works. <sighs> okay, I don't even think I used reinforcements. Not that it's particularly useful because, you know, it only gives me one molar. Oh, you know, there was gold right there. Oh, yummy yummy gold that I missed. Is this producing? Yes it is, even though I don't own the place. I should probably get on that, by the way. Okay, get out of the way, all of you. Oh my god, I did not lose anything! Well, the computer didn't. Oh god, Kappas. But stones. I want stones. Oh god. Uh, stay behind rocks. Yeah, that's, that's a superb idea, stay behind rocks. Oh god. Don't get... Ah, oh, they're gonna get lucky. Shoot. Um... Die? Shoot. Because they're going to... They're going to jump, like, next turn. <laughs> I, I don't want them to jump, see? And you can't even get to them. That's just stupid. Alright, hold on. Uh, you can die. Man, I didn't think it would be th this literal. Okay, you go there, and I don't think they can actually uh, jump on you, but just in case. I just don't want them to jump on me. Okay? That's the best way to take damage, is to have Kappa's jump on you. You have a straight arrow, that's interesting. Uh, I would love to use my hero's attack, uh, however I can't because I need reinforcements right about now, I think. Ah, uh, boy. Okay. You die. You get in there and kill them. Don't give them a jump, more importantly. That's all this is. Oh man, luck without the luck thing here. Oh, they got lucky too. God damn it. They're gonna attack the molars again. I hope they don't kill anything. Things are gonna get ugly otherwise. Good! They just barely didn't kill anything, which means they're dead. Here. I do things I don't normally do here to not take damage, like moving shooters. When do you ever move shooters? You usually don't. One is army, the upgraded versions, no less. Oh dear god, several? No, that's not happening. Just not happening. Too many of them. Oh dear god, uh, I, apparently there's too many of those as well. Well, we'll see what we can do about that. No oh god, <laughs> yeah, that's a lot. Okay, you are losing almost all your stack, and you are not getting involved ever. Well, not in a few turns, at least. God, why are you so fast? <laughs> don't, don't be so fast, I don't like it when you're this fast. Oh my god, they're fast! I was not prepared. I could go kill this. That would work. Relatively good. I wonder, can they do like 30 damage when there are 5 of them? I'm tempted. I'm very tempted. Okay, go for it. I am going to have to reinforce the first though, instead of attacking again, which was, which is what I was hoping for, but they have way too much movement for me to actually do anything else. I was hoping I could attack something with my molars and be out of range of this guy, which just did not happen. You know what? Kill one. 
this is a surefire way to kill something, and you wouldn't have killed anything there. 25... Uh... Yeah, I, I'm, I'm still happy I played it safe. Because there's poison damage. Okay, it's not big poison damage. It's still poison damage. Poison damage is scary. Okay, kill this. Oh god, they're gonna get to the goblin next turn. No. Well, I can kill this and then kill these with the goblins. Yeah, you know what? Goblins go. You can do that by pressing Alt, by the way. If you press Alt, your shooter is gonna attack melee instead. I decided to do that here. For no good reason, by the way. I had no reason to do that. But I did it anyways. Um, oh god. Please don't take losses. I'm tired of fighting these fights. Please don't take losses. <sighs> Guess I have to do things now. So it's gonna divide it into three stacks. Gotcha. Oh dear god. I'm, I'm scared. They're gonna attack molars as usual. Please kill one. Please. Please. God damn it! How much damage can they do? I'm curious. Why do they keep failing? Does it require them to do like maximum damage or something? I don't get it. Why are you so bad? It's a worthy question. Okay, you are dying. Because I really don't care for you. Uh, initiative of 40 versus 30. Killing 5 is not going to change anything. Okay, kill him now. Yeah, you see, it's 13 to 19 damage, so I guess, yes, it's a little unfair to expect them to always... to always expect them to, to get the kill. Because, you know, it would require them doing maximum damage. They can't always do that. Okay, you're dead. You're not dead? What? Oh, come on. That's ridiculous. Completely and utterly ridiculous. Okay, you die. I said die! God damn it! This game doesn't like me. Okay, you did. You did. And you're gonna run away and not move first, hopefully. Doesn't... not like it... okay, you're gonna move first. Fine. Still doesn't matter, because Crag Hack... Oh, 2 HP. I could have cast Heroism and farmed myself one blood reputation. But no, I was kinda dumb. It's, oh boy. No. Not happening. I can get to this flag, though. But I just want to go the other way. So, yeah. If I remember correctly, my town is going to be somewhere around here. Stay away from K, crazy old man curse! Okay. Good. I'm glad I know... Ugh. I'm going blood. Fortunate, but I had to... I had to lose some mana there. Okay, I'm... Wow. I didn't learn much, but at least I have a lead. There's a rock in the middle of the reef barrier that's surrounded by clouds and lightning. The islanders call it the Thunder Peak. If the bird is nesting somewhere in the area, it's there. They also told me there's a frightening old man who lives on a cay nearby. They told me to stay away or he'll cast a spell on me or something. But I better have a look. Um, so, I didn't have to do anything, but I lost all my mana. Was it a good trade-off? I have my doubts. Okay, first off, I want heroes. Probably can't recruit them just yet. Oh, I can. Can I? Dear God. Well, that's good. Yeah, give me a harp. Oh, no, I can't. 5,000, that's a lot, and I have absolutely crap all for money. And everything's really strong. Oh, boy. Yeah. I can kill this. Uh, Water elementals. There's a few of them. It's, pro it's probably a few too many, but, you know, gotta do what you gotta do. I need money. I also need to get up there. The, the rock mine is actually over there. Oh, boy. Hmm. 
Well, okay, I'm gonna go there. Just because it, it's gonna give me money every time I kill something. And really, that's something I kinda need. I also need to keep on building, even though I don't really have the money for it. Ah, uh, yeah, build this. Money! I get a thousand per turn now. It's better than what I was getting. Hold on. Okay, it's still few. It's four. I, I'm probably gonna take losses here. There's no way I'm not taking losses here. Oh boy. I'm still playing faster than them, somehow. You know what? Reinforcements are probably not gonna help. Oh boy. Um, so what I'm gonna do is give them a lot of healing instead. Uh, I think. Well, you know what? I'm gonna give them reinforcements anyways. Go ahead and kill it. Probably more. Yeah, they're gonna kill one. But they're gonna kill more than that next turn. I'm not gonna kill them before they get to cast again. That's for damn sure. Oh god, 8 to 13 damage. I'm so happy you can attack with full damage. Yay. God. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's kill one. That's a good start, is it? Okay. And then do this so that I'm sure to kill another one next time. Next time I want to do something, at least. Uh, you... Well, I'm going to cast reinforcements on you next turn, regardless of what happens, so might as well. Get lucky! Yeah! Eat it! Okay, this this water woman is going to crush me, but I have I have reinfor not reinforcements, regeneration. That should be fine. Okay, cast your thing. And let me regenerate it. There we go. Okay, you can dodge now. Not dodge. What? Dodge? No, defend. There you go. I can talk. Yes I can. Alright, now we can kill this. Oh man, straight arrow. You can actually do damage. Oh, I was not expecting that. Almost. Okay, no, no, no losses. Still doing pretty alright. I need money. Kind of like this. Um, kind of like this as well. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna kill these molars. It's gonna be uh, go there for each combat. Yeah, I know. Oh, wow. Well, I, I guess I'm going to be stuck here for a little bit. Until I can actually get some money. Um, this chest actually is exactly what I need. I'm not sure I could get it with my current hero. Just because my current hero is kind of fucking weak. Oh, I don't want to pursue you guys. Don't have a choice though, I'm going blood and yeah, you're gonna be a little short on reputation points in this map, believe me. Okay, um, I'm gonna attack these and keep these out of the fight and be happy. Okay, they're not exactly kept out of the fight. I guess I should have kept these out of the fight and attacked the other one. Uh, doo -doo -doo. That's actually a bad idea. But now I'm out of range, so whatever. Oh god, that is such a bad idea. Mm. Mm. I'm unhappy with myself. I should not have moved them there. I was a little cowardly. More than a little, it was very cowardly. <sighs> Wait for it. They are dumb enough to come at me, that's good, but now I have nothing to stop them from getting to the goblins I needed to move the molars before that. I was just dumb on my part. Okay, reinforce these. Although... Boy. You see, I could do that. But that would not help. At all. Ugh. Ah, <sighs> well, uh, they're probably 
my goblins are likely to take a loss or two, I don't know. Oh my god. Yeah, these can get to them and yep, they're going for it. Ugh. I made a mistake. Happens sometimes. You just gotta deal with them. Yeah, you laugh at him. Oh boy. Yeah, okay, you know what? I lost him. What do you want me to say? I just lost him. No reason to lose another one. Just go and kill them. The molar. Besides, the molars are more useful than the goblins. I can live with losing two goblins. Oh, yes, I can. I can, and I will. You know what? I should probably get more stacks of goblins in and use those, um, 